What is up, gamers? This is Griever TV, and I am Griever. Tonight, I'm bringing you a NZ Fortress Fresh Meat League interview hosted by none other than Thorndike. So I says to the neutron who got a drink, I says, look, mate, there's no charge for you. <laughs> 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 uh, 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 it seems we have started. Well, yes, welcome to another Fresh Meat League interview, or a film cast, as I like to say in the business, an FML cast. This is just a time where I catch up with various competitors in the competition, and we go through and see what's happening and see how their experiences are going. Tonight, I have three guests, Sephora, Luki, and Mongo. Welcome, guys. Hiya. So, it's here I am. It's great to have you here, and it's great that we'll be able to hear about your experience in the uh, tournament that's been going on. Um, so, what I'm just going to do is go through you one at a time, and we'll just get some background on what uh, team you're in, um, who's your mentor, and then I'll have some follow-up questions from that. So, Sephora, we're going to start with you. All right. How are you going? Not bad, yourself. Pretty good. All right, and what clan are you in, Sifro? I'm in Blank Slate, or and Blank who? Slate. Right, and who's your mentor? Uh, Taffy and Blank. Fantastic. So uh, one of the themes we're going with this interview is just sort of up-and-coming um, players, people who have been quite noticeable within the FML community. And I know Sifro, because I particularly use you for this, you are... Uh, asked to sub in a lot of teams. In fact, you could say that um, you are one of the biggest sluts in this tournament to come. Um, how does that make you feel? Uh, yeah, I got told that a lot, but they say there's no shame in being a shut. Oh my god, there's no shame <laughs> in being a slut. Other way around. Yeah, so um, I love sluts. what has that been, like how has it been for you going within different teams? Uh, it was pretty good. I was just keen for experience because every game you learn something. Also, they say. Mhm. Mm um. Well, actually, I should have started. Where? What was your beginnings with TF2? Like, did you start off pubbing, or how did that go? Uh, yeah, started off pubbing, just switching to a different class every time I die, rage quitting out of it, and then eventually stuck with soldier. Okay. And so, where did you hear about the FML tournament? Um, I think I got invited through a friend. I can't actually remember. Okay. I think I so, think Soldier told me. Yeah, that's awesome. that's how it was, right? Yeah. Um. So how long had you been playing TF2 without being in competitive mode? I think I had maybe three, maybe four hundred hours of TF2. Wow. And what did you particularly like to play back then? Uh, I think. I liked Soldier for the most part, like that was my most played class, but I switched around a lot. So do you know what sort of, what made you decide that, yeah, I'll give this a go? What was it that you weren't getting in perhaps pubbing that you thought you might get in competitive play, or was it nothing like that? Um, very competitive gamer in all games I played. I played a lot of Counter-Strike with competitive play there is where I started doing competitive play, but nothing in TF2. I started watching some videos on YouTube and that sort of thing. And sort of give it a go. Right, so how have you found, has it been, this might be a really silly question, but have you found it way, way different, the transition between competitive Counter-Strike and then Team Fortress 2? Uh, the communication is the key, really, I think, in competitive play in both games. So yeah, it wasn't too different, like calling wherever it is and that sort of thing, which is the same in Counter-Strike. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it wasn't too much of a transition, apart from the fact the game is completely different. Okay. Um, Taffy says that you are the next corpse. Do you think this is a compliment or a death threat? Um, I'll take it as a compliment. Okay, I'm sure corpse will be glad to hear about that. Um, so how have you found the, your games, um, like your official matches? Uh, we've gone pretty well so far. I think we're currently undefeated if uh, draws count as a win. But yeah, they've gone pretty well. Mm -hmm. How did you find subbing for the Greatest Clan GG tonight? Oh, we did pretty well. Uh, yeah, if you knew the scores, it was pretty well. Do you think, because one of the things you've got a reputation for, I know in our clan, is that you are a very decent sniper. Do you think Counter-Strike has something to do with that? Um, well, that's the only thing I can think of, because I don't have many hours played as sniper in TF2. But then again, I was a terrible author in Counter-Strike, so I don't know. 
Okay. Uh, well, thanks very much for that. Uh, did you have any other comments you wanted to say just now? Uh, Taffy's the best. Uh, no, we can just edit that out, <laughs> please. Thank you. Um, all right. I'm now going to move on to Lukey. How are you, mate? Good, thank you. Um, so, yes, uh, what clan are you currently in for FML? I'm with SS Shapeshift. And who is your mentor? Uh, Papa. Papa Hemp. Cool. So, yeah, what were your beginnings? Was it sort of straight into competitive play with you, or have you been around for a bit? I spent, before I had a PC that could actually play games, I spent about 200 hours at a net cafe playing TF2. Oh, wow. Um, and, like, you have a bit of a reputation, uh, my understanding is, for being a really good spy back in those days. Was that correct? Uh, yeah, I got 600 hours clocked up on it. Okay, would you say you're better than Virus? At Scout or Spy? Bye. The correct answer to this question is, who is Virus? Yeah, <laughs> I've seen him play in... I've played in pub games with him quite a bit. I don't know, I'd say we're pretty even. I think the thing is, have you written a guide? No. Okay, then Virus is better. Okay, Virus can be better. <laughs> so you... You spent your time in the net cafes and clocking up all those hours, and that was really just pubbing. How did you get into this FML tournament? Um, a friend who trialed for it failed horribly, and he said that I should give it a go. So I did, and I got in. Cool. So how have you found the transition to competitive play? How are you finding the tournament? Um, it actually makes TF2 a lot more fun. I was getting horribly bored of pub games. Cool. So, like, do you have any ideas or reasons why, like, you are probably one of the most threatening scouts in the FML League, but even though in our scrims against you, um, you have some of the biggest meet shots when you're facing KB, and we, with our scouts that have uh, quite a lot more experience in competitive TF2, do you know what's brought that about? Uh, sorry, what's been brought about? It's like, what's made you such a good scout, do you reckon? I have no idea. I barely played any scout until I started playing it for FML. Um, probably my scent, maybe just being where I need to be. Good at that, maybe. Cool. All about positioning. Yeah, because as scout, you can just get there fast. So how do you feel like... Um, your team obviously is doing very well. How do you feel you'll do in the semis, or do you think you think you'll reach the finals? I th I'm pretty sure we'll reach the finals. Not going to let it get to my head though, because there are still plenty of scouts that can DM me just as well as I can kill them. Cool. Did you have any um, thing further you wanted to add? Not really. Cool. Well, thanks very much there, Lukey. Uh, our final guest is Mr. Mongo himself, the person who goes around pubbing on servers with just his Taj and Charge, his, uh, that new pipe launcher and his um, melee weapon. How are you it's going, It's legitimate. Man? Oh, well, it seems to be legitimate. You keep killing me all the time. How are you? Good, mate. Cool. So, yeah, what clan are you on? Uh, I'm in GBH, Grievous Bodily Harm. Okay, and who is your mentor? I don't know. We, he hasn't shown up yet, so <laughs> when he does, I'll tell you. <laughs> Very cool. Um, so, yeah, I out of all three of the guests we've had today, Mongo is the one that I probably knew the most about, mainly because I got so frustrated at him in the pubs. So what were your beginnings with Team Fortress 2? Um, I bought the orange box because someone said that um, Portal was a fun game to play and then... I loaded this up and I've been playing it for about 1,400 hours after that. Very cool. And what made you come into competitive play? How did you get roped in? Uh, it really was just um, uh, the FML tournament. So Taffy said we're starting a tournament for new players and that sounded really good to me. So, yeah. Awesome. I noticed... You have some of the most annoying aim with your pipes as a demo. For instance, in the scrim I recently subbed in for our team, you probably mitted me about five times when I was jumping. Now, I jump very straight, so it might be quite easy. But um, how do you feel you got to such a level with your aim as a demo? Uh, I, I really don't know. I think... Um... 
just recently it started coming in that I could hit people in mid-air, I guess. Uh, I don't know, I still don't think I have a great aim, but I keep checking out spike pipes, and eventually some will hit. And how have you found the FML experience so far? It's really good. It's really, like Lickie was saying, it's, pubs have lost a lot of interest for me now, and it's, it's all about these organised games. Very cool. Um, did you have anything that you wanted to add? Yeah, if you could stop taunt killing me, that'd be great. <laughs> uh, no, I can't say. Um, I do have a question for all three of you. Like, after this competition has ended, what do you guys want to do? Do you want to keep playing competitive play in the same clans, or you might branch out? How do you, what do you feel you'll be doing after this? Lukey, we'll go with you. Sorry, what? Yep, I'm here. Do I have mm -hmm. to repeat the question? Yes. Yes, you do. I was just asking all three of you, what do you see yourself doing after the actual tournament's finished? Like staying in competitive uh, play, being in a different uh, clan, um, improving with the same clan? Probably improving with the same clan at this rate. Right? Cool. Any of the other guys want to respond? Uh, probably branch out, although I'll probably still stick around with the same clan as well. I'm not sure we'll see what they want to do. Wait. There's, um, yeah, I don't know if I'll, I'll be able to keep putting as much time in as I am now, so if we can keep playing competitive and cut it back a bit, then I'm keen for that. Awesome. All right, we're going to move now on to a quiz for us to finish up on. Uh, the winner of this quiz is eligible. Uh, the prize, uh, you can s figure out whether you think it's a good or a bad prize, is is you'll get... No. Don't be stupid. Uh, Will be one hour of my time to do what you with what you want to. So that could so be. Yours, wow, I am so uncomfortable right now. <laughs> so that could be, if you want me to, like for example, your um, Mongo, your mentor no, who never no, turns no, up. No, no, I can no. come in and I can just. You can stick, sit on Uncle Thorndike's knee and we can talk about stuff. You see, I'm looking pretty maybe fucking good. Organize, this is the for Thorndike. I could maybe organise a shout cast with me and Griever, and we spend an hour doing that on one of your matches. But um, yeah, we can decide about that afterwards through private PMs and all that kind of stuff. So <laughs> I'm going to start with uh, the questions, and you just need to think of a buzzer. Or do you just want to say your name if you've got the answer? Could we just say Buzz? Okay. And I will... So it's basically the first person to answer all the questions, and then we'll go through and find out who the winner is. Okay. Is everybody ready? Yep. Yep. Lucy, I'm looking at you. Mm-hmm. Okay. Awesome. So you need to fill in the blank. Mum's the... Buzz. Word. Fantastic. Good one. All right, question two. Name a map played in round three or four in the FML tourney. Granary. Buzz. Luke, you're, Luke, you're buzz. Mic, but buzz. Buzz. Up well. I'm oh, sorry to wait to say buzz and then wait. <sighs> Did, Luke, you light it up first. What was your answer? Granary. Fantastic. Yeah, you have to say buzz. And say My bad. Yeah, I'll say buzz next time. Okay, Wonderstruck is in which FML clan? Buzz, Gigi. He said that. Sifro? Sifro. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, well, no, first. Okay, no. name another King of the Hill map that is being played in this tournament that is not Viaduct. Buzz, Eshel. Oh, okay, <laughs> come on, Mongo. My boy. Pick up game. Yes. Um, who has the most points currently for Buzz. the FML? Yes, Buzz. Yes. Buzz. Buzz. Was, yes, uh, Buzz. Yes. Mongo oh, Buzz, Buzz first. Mongo Buzz first. Buzz. Jesus. Mongo. Yes, yes. Ah, uh, there we go. All right. Name three mentors. Buzz. Buzz. Mongo. We have Thorndike, Griever, maybe, and Taffy. Awesome. Okay. Name two custom or community-made maps in the tournament. Buzz. Buzz. Who? Uh, you take it, Lukey. <laughs> um, viaduct and gravel pit. Incorrect. Okay. 
Buzz. Who was that? That was Mongo. Mongo. I'm going with Snake Water and Viaduct. Cool. I'll give you, like, we'll say Pro Viaduct is sort of a uh, custom one, not the original Viaduct. Well, I'll give you that. Good work. Okay. As requested in the last FML mentor meeting, has the rules for this tournament been stickied in the forum so not to cause a two or three page search for them? <laughs> Buzz, yes. The four. Buzz, no. Yeah, Mongo's correct. <laughs> it hasn't been stickied. Um, name the month that the Epic LAN A6 is being held and what city? Buzz. Lukey. August. Auckland. Buzz. Yes, Auckland. Sifra. February. Yes, Sifra, you're close. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what? Okay. Um, what's the current best comedy TV series is voted by myself and Camo? Emmy. Can we have a hint? Um, it's a US series. This doesn't sound like something they should actually know. Um, and it's not in front of a live studio audience. Ah, buzz. Leaky. Big Bang Theory. Take a jab at it. Ah, I see what you did there. Uh, I said it's not in front of a live studio audience. It's not. Uh, it's just canned laughter, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, okay. I was The answer I was looking for was community. So no oh, one good. gets the point for that. Okay. TF2 came out in which year? Buzz, 2004. Incorrect. Buzz. Mongo. 2009. Incorrect, Lukey. 2008. Oh, it's this 2007. Really a fresh meat league. <laughs> okay, fill in the blank. Pop it, don't blank it. Any ideas? Pop it, don't... Think gangster, I'm like pop it, don't lock it. <laughs> <laughs> that was the closest we've got. So, Sifra, I'm gonna give you that. It's pop it, don't <laughs> drop it. Because our medic never drops it. Okay, and what is it referring to? Buzz. Uh, Buzz. Mongo? The uh, medic dropping Uber. Fantastic. Okay. Um, Griever TV recently covered TF2 at the STL LAN. Who was his co-caster for these matches? Buzz. Thorndike. No. Think someone internationally famous. Buzz. Yep. Mongo. Comedian. Fantastic. That is correct. Okay. Um, in Kiwi Bacon, that's my claim. A uh, clan, sorry. The demo man is often referred to with either an audible sigh, but is also known by the name Camo. What hilarious nickname do I call him that involves changing one letter of his name? Camo. To what? Buzz. Lukey. Shit. I think no. I'm through. I'm going with Hamo. No. <laughs> Be funnier. Pamo? <laughs> Any, okay, it's all right. Lam I, Lamo? Yes, Taffy, you can have one bonus point. It's Lamo. Oh, that, that is right funny. Now. Okay, uh, who is my missing co-caster? It rhymes with Lemmy. Buzz Jimmy? Yes, correct. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Okay, uh, FML is an acronym for what? Buzz, Fresh Buzz. Meat League. Who said that? Sephora. Okay. My acorn is an anagram for what word? I've said the word in the last 15 seconds. My acorn. The correct answer, of course, is acronym. So oh, my suck. acorn is an anagram for acronym. Okay. Um, my name is Cuba Pete, and I'm the king of what kind of beat?
No answers. Do you have to actually read the junk mail uh, in your email folder buzz, to answer these questions? Buzz, yes, rumba, rumba beat. Yes, that's correct. It what? was from the hit movie <laughs> The Mask. The hell? That's the one. Jim Carrey. <laughs> okay. cracked out the Google. He said that's Sifra. Yeah. Okay, final question. Uh, what is a password... No, you, let, you have to let me finish the question. What is a password for the recently created Mumble FML channel that we can all ha hang buzz. out in? And not so and socialize really. when we're not in serious game mode. Buzz. Mongo. <laughs> Fantastic. And with that, Mongo is the winner with eight points. Well done, Mongo. Uh, Sifra, you're close behind with seven. Oh. Ricky, you had one. So good, good effort. Uh, there. I try. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um, so that about wraps it up. Uh, we'll just go through some quick shout outs. So, Lukey, do you have any shout outs? Not really, no. Okay. Mongo? Yeah, I'd like to shout out to GBH and maybe my mentor if he shows up. I'm, awesome. I'm, I'm right here, just God. And Sifra? Uh, shout out to Blank Slate and Taffy, my mentor, and GG, who played really well tonight versus TGF. Awesome. Okay, I'll just do a shout out to everybody who was involved in this, Griever and Taffy, and a special thank you to our interviewees. And also a big shout out to my main man, Jimmy, who couldn't make it tonight. Um, so keep on trucking, everybody. I don't really have a, a catchphrase to sign off with, but... Um, uh, Everybody hopefully is enjoying their games and best of luck for everybody's games. We will see you another time. Thank you very much. Righto, so we're going to wrap it see up ya. here, people. Uh, just going to quickly chuck in a thing at the end here. Make sure you check out uh, NZ Fortress in the Fresh Meat League. That is www.nzfortress.co.nz or www.tf2.co.nz. And uh, yeah, check out our community. And of course, if you want to catch some live shoutcasting, check out Griever TV on YouTube. Have a good night. If you like what you've just seen, click on the links to check out more Team Fortress 2 coverage by GTV. Remember that you can help us promote Team Fortress 2 by subscribing and liking the videos.